Hey guys, it's Mandy from Daydream Face Painting. Today I'm going to show you this fun rainbow design using this, the tag rainbow cake in the color Leanne's Rainbow. This is the brightest, prettiest, most vivid rainbow cake that I know of, and I love it and I use it all the time, and I also use the Leanne's Rainbow One Stroke as well. It's my favorite. So if you guys would like to see how I did this, keep watching. So first I'm just going to spritz some water on my half circle fantasy worldwide sponge and then I'm going to take my tag Leanne's rainbow cake and rub the sponge across vertically to load it up. Next I'm going to come to the inner corner of my eyebrow and at an angle I'm going to pat it up toward my hairline. And next I'm only going to be using the bottoms of the colors and not the top so I don't get it muddied up. I'm just going to go at an angle down across the bottom of the cheekbone. And then I'm just gonna flip the sponge and do the same exact thing on the other side. This rainbow cake is just so bright and vivid. Little girls love this when you use this on them for rainbow butterflies or any kind of rainbow design. And next I'm going to be using a stencil that I actually got as a free gift with purchase from the Face Paint Forum shop. Um, a similar one to this would be the BAM Pack Stencil number 3005. And now I've just flipped the stencil over to make a mirror image on the other side and I'm using DFX White on my Fantasy Worldwide sponge and just patting over the top of the stencil. I'm using the stencil a lot in this design. Um, I really like these swirls and curls. They're fast, they're pretty, and you don't have to do a lot of line work. You just have to know how to use the stencil well. And next, I'm gonna be using the star pattern from my Graffiti Eye stencil set. Um, and I'm gonna be using this over the top of the yellow portion on each side. And next I'm just going to dab some Afterglow Cosmetic Glitter in the Iridescent Pearl White color just on the empty spaces of the design, not all over, although you could add it all over. I didn't want to overwhelm the design with glitter, I just want to add it, add it to some empty spaces. Next, I'm going to make some dots on the design. Three dots coming down from the top of the red color and then a few on the outer corner of the eye. The secret to making good dots is to really load your brush well and almost get it to the point where your brush is dripping with the white in order to make really great dots. And to take this design up another notch, I'm going to add some skin friendly adhesive to the back of a big gold gem and I'm going to put it right in the center of the design. And next I'm going to load up some of the bright pink color to use as lipstick. And then I'll just add another dab of glitter right at the center of the bottom of my lips. And that's it. That's the finished rainbow swirly design. I hope you guys like this and you can try it out at your next event. Thanks for watching.